Hello everyone, welcome back to Crossword. It's Friday, March 29th. Let's wrap up the month, I guess. 30 days, half September. I mean, I guess there's a 31st of March, right? So there'll be a Monday. Whatever, not wrapping up the month. But the week at least. Thrower of a reception. Who throws a reception? Like a couple getting married? I don't know. Oh, or like a quarterback? Throws a reception? Interesting. Home to the world's largest population of Indian rhinos. Well, you would think India, but maybe not. I mean, it must not be. They can't really do that with Indian in the clue. I am innovator. That must be AOL instant messenger they're talking about. Breaks down. Could be rots, like, you know, biologically breaking down, but... Could be a million things. Emoji that might be used in response to a funny text. Are they just looking for a smile here or? Hmm. Felt crummy. Let's try ailed. That's usually what they want when someone's sick in the crossword. <clears throat> Card game combos. Pairs? Like a pair is a combination of two cards in poker? I don't know. Sweet message bearer, like a candy heart. I don't know. Could end with chocolate, actually, couldn't it? If ailed were wrong. Let's look around down here. The Book of Mormon org. I mean, that was a musical by the South Park guys. I don't know what their org is. Oh, but the, the actual Book of Mormon. I don't, for some reason, the, the quotes make me think of the play rather than, like, the actual book. The, La the Church of Latter-day Saints uh, would be associated with the actual Book of Mormon. And then we get ailed back. Drag Racer? Someone racing in drag? I don't know. So it doesn't look like... Oh, oh I would have done this wrong anyway. It would have been collate here, right? Hmm. Place for bucks at the bar. Bar is lowercase, so I don't think they can be talking about the bar association. Bucks could mean dollars, you know, could mean, like, uh, deer. I don't know. Lecture. A rant. Uh, to lecture is to orate. Geometry suffix. Like, mm, po mm, like a polyhedron, a Polygon? Let's try that. Large combo. A word that goes together with large? What if he's an extra large, maybe? That's a word that combos with large. No, the speed of sound is Mach 1. Anyone's game, it's a close one. It's a nail biter. It's tied. It's one all. I don't know. Large combo. Large and in charge. Blank acid. Folic acid exists. Amino acid is more common for crosswords, though. GM. Well, great mysteries are enigmas. Okay, good. Or enigma? You don't pluralize it like that, do you? No. Hunks of plastic? Is this about plastic surgery somehow? Hunks? Not quite sure. Turn off. To turn 
off. To shut off is to turn off. Trying to get a hold of, calling, I don't know. Drenched, drenches to sop. Anyone's game is a toss up. Large combo, ocean. Why would that make any sense? Ochre. Occam's Razor. Lecture. A lecture is a talk series. It's a tangent. It's was ready for. Felt up to? I'll try it. Screw off, untwist, like a like a screw top. You can untwist it if you screw it off. Come on, people. Okay, this is looking good. Typing measure words per minute. For me, they got to use words per second, baby. Uh, contents of a drug shipment. That sounded like a reference. That was just me talking. Uh, contents of a drug shipment. Pills. Those who've gone wrong. I don't know. Could be talking about criminals. Could be talking about people who are lost. I don't know. Informal negation. Ain't. Tripping. You are on LSD? Maybe. Dialing. What am I doing? Dialing. Eh. Hunks of plastic? Is that... Pans? Puns? What is this? I don't get it. Pins. Is a pin a hunk of plastic? Like a bowling pin? I don't quite understand. This looks good here. I thought, hmm, ML? Maybe this isn't pills? They're only human. I mean, it can't be, right? Ones who might roast you, like an announcer at a roast. Or a detractor. Tripping. I'm going to try on LSD. First book in the series, A Song of Fire and Ice, Game of Thrones. Spoil everything if you blow it. Ones who might roast you. Cannibals? I guess they would roast you. They could roast you if they were thinking of eating you, yeah? Solving puzzles, e.g. It's a pastime. Form a connection where sparks fly is to weld. A commotion is an ado. They're only human. People. Christ the Redeemer wore a facsimile of his jersey in 2023. What? Really? That seems kind of tacky, but Pele, I guess. Christ the Redeemer statues in Brazil. Pele is a famous like soccer legend, so I guess they gave him a giant. Is a is a huge statue. They made like a you know 60 foot jersey to put on him, I guess. I don't know how tall the statue is. 60 feet seems small. Like, that's a very tall statue. 60 feet is a tall statue, but I feel like that statue is huge. Let's look that up. How tall is Tricer Nemer's statue? Ninety-eight feet high. Thirty meters for y'all from more sensible places. Greeted someone across the room. Waved at? I don't normally let myself look stuff up during the crossword, but it wasn't to help me find the answer here, and I was curious, so... Oh, mortals. So anyway, it seemed fair enough. It's my rule anyway. I can do whatever I want. Totally clear. Well, this doesn't look good. It's not an ado? Braced for impact? We could say tensed? 
off-target remark. If you were off-target with a joke, you might say, I'm sorry. Hmm. Maybe a commotion is a din. Totally clear. I don't know. Could be wipe out? No. Wiped out, I guess. Could be, right? Wiped off? Hmm. Jumble is a mess. Wide open is totally clear. I missed, you would say if you were off target. Even more straightforward than what I thought about, I'm sorry. Cartoonish cry, eek. One of the Minecraft protagonists, Steve. A drug shipment. They don't ship silos. I don't get it. Those who've gone wrong, uh, deserters, have gone from the military in the wrong way. Hunks of plastic. Pens? Why? Yens? Lens? Lens. Mm. So you can make a lens out of plastic. But it says plural, right? Hunks. Is there a famous person named Len who is considered a hunk? And multiple of him would be hunks of plastic? Why would they be plastic? I don't know. Ken! A Ken is a plastic hunk. And a kilo... Drug shipment could be measured in kilos. Okay. Animal whose singular and plural is the same is a moose or a goose, actually. Hang on. No, geese. Much of Azerbaijan's population. Uh, Arab? Spanish letter with or without a tilde. Enne or enye are the N and the N with the tilde over it. All bent out of shape. Warped? Bust? don't know question asked while tapping hey is anyone home i don't know all good here could be clear that doesn't seem right computer acronym since the 1960s eniac is that when that was around i think that's got to be the answer like what else that's the only famous computer acronym i can think of that's five letters like famous enough to be in the new york times Deep divide. It could be a schism. Doesn't fit. Saint something? I don't know. I don't know. I'm not so sure about this ENIAC thing. I'm going to put Arab back. To feel the pain is to burn. Fancy? You fancy something if you want it, I suppose. Fancy a drink? Give a card in a way, like a ref in a soccer game gives a card? Or like give someone a business card? Or you pay if you give a credit card? Let's put that in for now. All good here, yeah, I have no idea. To blank coy mistress. His makes sense as that title, but I've never heard of it, and it doesn't seem to fit the crossword. This could be waved two, actually. June to Jupiter. No, Juno to Jupiter. Uh... Well, I mean, obviously they're talking about the Greek and Roman pantheon of gods. I don't really remember who Juno was. Like, I'm much more acquainted with the Greek pantheon than the Roman one. And these are the Roman name. This is the Roman name for Jupiter. I'm not sure about Juno. It could be that it was Hestia. But it wasn't... Wasn't Hestia like a Greek one? Why would Jupiter call Juno Hestia? That doesn't make sense to me. Doctrines are tenets, so it looks like no. 
Waved to or waved at? Sister? Oh, is Juno just Hera? She is, right? That makes sense. So waved high then. Yeah, I think Juno is Hera. Canine, whoa, mange is a thing dogs would be woeful to have. Sauron's realm, Mordor. Bust. Something handed, something... Hang on. Thing on. It looks like handed his ha thing on. Is this thing on? You might say, uh, while tapping on a mic. Okay, so it's not ENIAC. Computer acronym. EA? Keeping in mind that Eek might be wrong. It could be like Ack. I mean, honestly, let's just get rid of this whole thing. Deep Divide is a... a, 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 a mm. Saint don't know. Feel the pain is to ache. Give a card in a way. Tip? Not really, right? To catch red-handed is to bust someone. You give a card in blackjack if you hit. All good here. I'm set. ASCII, the... What is... What does ASCII stand for? American Standards Computer Information Interchange, probably? Anyway, it's, you know, the most basic format for exchanging text as binary. Deep Divide is a chasm. Ack. St. Kitts? I don't know what that is, but Shia makes sense. This looks like Octet, but why would that... Oh, large combo. Yeah, of course. I was thinking OCT was supposed to be lecture, but no. An Octet is a large combo. Eight of something. Or eight somethings. A magician might use a hidden magnet, I suppose? Mm, I don't like that. This should be talk, right? To lecture is to talk... At or talk to? Oh, this came up just the other day, the enlightened Buddhist thing. I have no idea what the word for that was. A hidden ticket, a hidden blanket, a hidden market. Don't delay ASAP. Stat. Well, since this is lecture, either talk to or at. I don't think it can be ASAP. So let's try stat. Place for bucks at the bar. Menu. Animal. Call. This looks like animal. Nope. Pull back is to recoil. Sweet message bearer. Fortune cookie. Metallical. No. A hidden pocket, sure. Mechanical. Mechanical bowl. Oh, a bar can have a mechanical bowl, and those have bucks, I guess. 
Do they? Doesn't seem quite right, but... Oh, a ball bucks, right, the verb buck. And you can nounify that. Arhat, I think? Thrower of a reception is the passer. Yeah, it was the same thing that came up the other day. Highlight is the sun. It is a light that is high up in the air. Well, not in the air. In the sky. Breaks down. Probably ends with S. Sobs. You sob if you break down. Emoji in response to a funny text. Did someone say skull? What the hell? I'm not in touch with the youth at all. Drag racer is a sled. You can drag a sled. It races. Card game combos are melds. Okay. You send someone a skull in response to a funny text? I've never... Am I... I'm dying, LOL? Is that, like, what that means? Wow, I'm old. Fawn's mother, a doe. Carreru pigeons? Fall out of trees after eating fermented fruit? Are these myths? I don't get it. Starbucks size. Are they drunk? Starbucks size is grande. I don't know. Save for later viewing. DVR. Aventi. Went go, go, go. Raced. C in French is mare. No, not the spelling bee. Knock it off. The wordle. They tried to trick me into playing the spelling bee, but I won't, I won't hear it. Okay, uh, 12 day streak, here we go. Let's try Dream, that was in the crossword today. For the mini anyway, wow. Amber? Amber's in the wrong place, you got it, that's true. Wow. R-M maybe, or E-M-A? Like Larum? Werum? What the heck could this be? Irum. As, as, as rum. Artem. No, the R would be in the wrong place. It's not a word. It's also not a word. I'm like, I'm, I'm stun locked. I can't think of any words that use all four of these letters and have an M at the end, but aren't in this order. Like, yeah, I could say cream. It's not a very good one. And because I play on hard mode, I can't just like guess some random letters. I have to find one that could legally be the answer. <sighs> EM. Does Wordle let you guess the same word twice? Could I guess dream again if I wanted? Obviously that would not be a strategically sound choice. It just occurs to me, I don't know if they would forbid that. I'll uh, uh, alt alt <laughs> Art no. Smear nope. M's in the wrong place. Param Her harem. Harem uses those letters. It's all still wrong. A totally different orientation. Wow. Come on, give me some credit. That was a good poll. Uh, so the R is first or fourth? If it were first, ah, oh, we could have realm. 
Yes. I wonder whether they would actually allow Harem in the New York Times. They might not. In which case, Realm would have been a better guess. Wordlebot would have told me that, I guess, if I'd asked. But who cares? Let's do the connection. Happy, pretty, shiny lady. I like it. Hmm. Sky blue, navy blue. Are they doing blues again? Baby blue. I don't recognize another blue here, though. Goofy and Daisy are, like, associated with Mickey Mouse. I don't see another, though. Army ants? Army navy. I don't see the Air Force here, though, or the Marines. A colony of ants. The Mighty Ducks. Daisy Duck? Is is she a duck? Who is Daisy? I don't I think she's a duck, right? Maybe not. But I don't see any of the ducks anyway. Livery. I think it's like sky blue, navy blue, and baby blue. These seem pretty good. Right? Is there another blue? It's like, what else does sky and navy have to do with here? Nothing, right? Shiny blue. Very blue. Is that some... I'm sure that's some company's shade. Tiffany blue? Livery blue? Colony blue is what the Brits were wearing? <laughs> I don't know. Goofy is a snowboarding stance. Very, really pretty. These are just intensifiers. Mighty, these all kind of mean like a lot, especially. Okay. Happy, happy, shiny. Tiffany, this is a, a jewelry brand. Are any of the others jewelry brands? Maybe. I don't recognize any of them, though. Army and Navy? In addition to being branches of the military, they have, like, a football team. No one else really does, though. Goofy and Daisy. Like, I don't know. I kind of want these to somehow be a fictional character of some kind. <sighs> kind of lost here. Baby is a term of endearment. None of the rest of this really is. Daisy is a character from the Mario universe as well, I suppose, but nobody else really is. I 
I'm gonna guess some blues. I really don't know what's going on here. I'm content to lose today, apparently. Daisy wouldn't be blue, would it? Let's try Tiffany blue. I've never heard of Tiffany blue that I can recall, but okay, sure. Shiny, happy, goofy lady. These are, nope. These all have Y's at the end. They're adjectives. Well, Daisy isn't really. Ants have an army and a colony. Did I say that already? Nothing else really is related to ants that I can see. I'm gonna try all these and see if they make any sense. One away, I have no idea. <sighs> okay, so Lady and Daisy. Swapping them did not change how many were in the group. So the only one thing we can say for sure is that Daisy and Lady are in the same group. Ladybird, Daisy Bird, Lady Flower. There's like Lady Finger as a type of plant. Hmm. So I want to swap one of the other three in this group for Lady, I guess. Goofy lady, didn't know. These are, hang on. Are these? Disney characters. Yeah, okay, so more broadly. Who is lady? Oh, like lady and the tramp? Yeah, goofy and happy. Well, happy's a dwarf. Daisy. Where the heck is Daisy from? Oh, Disney, of course. I, I, like Mickey Mouse area. So is Goofy. Hmm. Shiny Colony. Livery Army? I don't get this. Body parts, of course. It's always wordplay. Arm, colon, liver, and shin, plus Y. I'm not very good at finding those. They're hard. Pardon my French. French fries should be in here somewhere, maybe. Doesn't look like it actually. Toast? <laughs> mm, it doesn't look like it. Okay, so maybe that's not what the French means. Raoul? No. Buff. I wonder if they include rough in here as a word. They do. Okay. Um, well, we have words here, which I expect will be part of the spangram. Something words, loan words. Loan wads, try again. Yeah. So words borrowed from French. <laughs> um b -b 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 butcher? Can't actually do that here, can you? No. Or, I mean, they could be borrowed from non-French, but I assume they're all going to be French with this hint. Oh, boy. Fluff. 
I'm at a loss for words here. Uh, this U and another U next to it can't really be connected, right? That's something. Uh, bra from Brassier? No, it has to be four letters at least, right? Yeah. Can I fit? I can almost spell trebuchet. I can't though. The B is in completely the wrong place and there's no T. So almost is maybe a bit of an oversell. Oh wait, maybe I can't treb. No. I really want to spell trebuchet. That's a good loving word. Watch it. Tre Rep, yeah, hmm. Clip. Apple. Where can I spell apple somewhere? I don't know. I don't even think we would call that a lone word. Chaos? Oh, well, no, that surrounds the eye. <sighs> I got the spangram. I feel like I should be able to do this without a clue, but I don't know how. Rehab. Trife. Trifectly. Replica? I spelled that replica anyway. Rep. I hate this damn. Oh, it's so hard to select letters. Replica. Yeah, but now I'm surrounding the C, so this can't be right. Alright, give me a hint, I guess. Chic? Yeah. Pal? I'm totally lost. <sighs> okay, I want another. Beret. Fitriep. What? Iftire. Chow chu churbua Okay, fine. I'm just gonna get this one with seven hints. Let me just fill out some other words that it, that are found here. Like fire. Um Give me Huh? What word is this? Oh, what? Buria? Buro? Bureau. Oh, it is Buro. I just, it just doesn't pronounce like English, okay. So is Salon in here somewhere? 
Sonai. Ferrucha. Fruxuai. Sale. <laughs> I really uh, can't think of any words, so I'm running out of room to make, uh, to just get hints, too. Ripple. Fape. Life. And lifer. Give me my next clue, please. Liaison. Okay. Surely now I'll have no chance but to get it right. <laughs> Chauffeur. Chauffeur. Okay. Apertif. God, I hate these words. Apertifi? What? Ap... What? Apertif. <laughs> There's only one word left, and I can't find it. Itifripa. <laughs> Ape. Apefriti. Apefitier. Uh, I don't have any idea. It differ it Okay, well, I've clearly lost today. I'm going to actually just cheat, I guess, so I can see what the answer was. Anagram online. There must be some site that does that. Internet anagram solver. I'm looking for an anagram for aperitifi, please. Aper. No anagrams found. No. 188 found, but only one... Aperitif? Do I not know how to spell aperitif? Aperitif? Is that really? I didn't know that sec that first I was in there, man. What the hell? Aperitif? Okay, well. Thanks, Internet, for spelling that for me. Toughest, uh... Toughest bangrams for me since the debut by a mile. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.